Hello guys, welcome to my channel Deco Mohammed Official. Today I want to focus on the unit advanced taxation subtopic uh, double taxation relief. Please, if you are coming here for the first time, uh, click on the subscription button and turn on the notification bell for more, more updates. Welcome. So under double taxation relief, this is whereby someone is working Someone is being taxed in a foreign country and his home country. Let's say if I have a taxable income here in Kenya, my home country, and I also have a taxable income in foreign country, if I, if I being taxed both the country, I will enjoy what is called double taxation relief. But there is a condition for you to enjoy a double taxation relief. There must be a treaty between those two countries. Here, here I'm having a question that was tested under CASNE, uh, May 2021, question, it was May 2021, the question, question 3C, question 3C, May 2021. I also have you on the board, you can see, uh, we have, uh, the question goes like this, we have Ali Salama is a resident taxpayer in Kenya, Ali Salama is a resident taxpayer in Kenya, during the year of income 2020, he had 4,380,000 4, from employment in Kenya. He had also received 480,000 from the United Kingdom, UK, which had a double taxation relief treaty. Double taxation relief treaty with Kenya. In UK, it was equivalent to 80,000. Required, number one, double taxation relief in Kenya. Number two, tax payable in Kenya by Mr. Ali Salama. Assume the following rates of tax applied throughout the year of income 2020. We have the annual tax pay, we have the rate of tax. From 1 to 288, we have, it was 10%. This is 10%. From 1 to 288, 10%. Then from 288 to 488, we have 15%. From 488 to 688, we have 20%. Then excess of 688, we have 25%. Personal relief to 800 per annum. Uh, this was the question, but also you can get it from number 3C under May 21 advanced taxation. What you need to know, we need to calculate three things. Total taxable income, then the Kenyan tax on foreign income, then we're able to get the foreign tax on foreign income. The first thing we are going to calculate is the total tax total tax on total income. Total tax on total income. Let's calculate that total tax on total income. So number one is total total tax on total in the question you are told the income he had from Kenya is 4,380,000 while he received 480 from UK. So total income is 4 million. You take 4,380,000, you add, you add the 480,000 that he got from that he got from UK. So if you take if you take uh, 4380 4,380,000 plus 480 you are able to get 4,860,000. 4,860,000. So that is the total tax on total income. So we need to calculate the tax liability on it. Let's calculate the tax liability on it. We know the total income is 4,860,000. We are going to use this. Uh, we are going to use this rate. From number one is 288. So the first one is 288. We call it the first. 288,000 the rate is 10% you will multiply by 10% if you get uh, 288 by 10% you are able to get 288 times 0 0.10 28,800 here you will see you will get 28,800 then we have next if you want to get next you get the difference between the preceding which is 488 from 288. You take 488, subtract 288. You will get 200,000. So you take that 200,000. Then multiply with, the next rate is 15%. 15%. 
So if you take 200,000 by 15, 200 by 0.15 is 30,000. You get 30,000. 30, then next, still 688 from 488 is 200, so you take 200, 200,000. The next rate is 20%, 20%. If you take 200 uh, twenty percent by 2.0, 200 times 0.2, 200 you will get 40,000, you will get 40,000. So you see, the last one is excess, excess of 688. For you to get the excess, for, for you to get the excess, we take the total income, total tax rate on this side, which is 200 plus 200 plus 288, which is 688. Then you subtract this total income from the 688. So you take 4,860,000. Subtract it from the 688,000 Then multiply with, with the next rate which is 25% This comes to how much? If you take uh, 4,860,000 Subtract it from 688 Then multiply by 25% You are able to get 1,043,000 1,043,000 So if we take 1,043,000, we add, we add them, we add the, we add the three, 1,043, 1,043,000 plus 40,000 plus 30,000, then plus 28,800, you are able to get 1,141,000, 1,141,800, this is gross tax liability, gross tax liability. 1,141,800, that's our gross tax liability. Then, that is the total tax on total income. That is step one. We have gotten the total tax on total income. The next thing is Kenyan tax on Kenyan income. We need to get the Kenyan tax on Kenyan income. So let me use this side. So, Kenyan tax, Kenyan tax, the Kenyan tax on Kenyan income. Kenyan tax on Kenyan income. Kenyan tax on Kenyan income. We are still going to apply. Remember, the income in Kenya was 4,380,000. The income was 4,380,000. So we, need, we need just do the same thing. So we take first, it is 288,000. Times 10%, you're able to get 28,800. Then next, next is 200,000. Then multiply by 10, by 15%, you're able to get 30,000. Then next, next is 200,000. Times 20%, times 20%, you're able to get 40,000. Now the excess, the excess will be different since our income here is 4,380,000. Now we take 4,380,000, subtract it from 688,000, then subtract it to 25%. So you get, if you take uh, 43, 4,380,000, subtract it from 688, then multiply by 25%, you get 923,000, 923,000. So, we add them, you take 923,000, 923,000, you add to 40,000, then add to 30,000, then add to 28,800. You will get 1,021,800, 1,021,000. 800. That is our gross tax liability. That is the Kenyan tax on Kenyan income. Now, lastly, we need to get the Kenyan tax on foreign income. We need to get the Kenyan tax on. We need to get the Kenyan tax on foreign income. The Kenyan tax on foreign income. 
So let's get the Kenyan tax on foreign income. Kenyan tax. Kenyan tax on foreign income. Now, Kenyan tax on foreign income, you get the difference between the gross tax liability of the total tax on total income minus the Kenyan tax on Kenyan income gross tax liability. So we get 1,141,800 uh, subtracted from 1021800. So that is the Kenyan tax on foreign income. It will be how much? 1,141,800 subtract from the answer 120,000. 120,000. By the way, I need to tell you the formula for the double taxation relief. Now, the formula for double taxation relief is the lesser of, for you to get the double taxation relief, you take the lesser of the foreign tax on foreign income, you take the foreign tax on foreign income, foreign tax on foreign income, foreign tax on foreign income, for a case, from the question we are giving it was 80,000, from the question it was 80,000 and then Kenyan tax Kenyan tax on foreign income Kenyan tax on foreign income which is 120,000 so between 80,000 and 120 80 is lesser so we take the 80 now our double taxation relief is 80,000 you just calculate the total tax on total income, then you get the Kenyan tax on Kenyan income, then you get the difference will, that will arrive for you, the Kenyan tax on foreign income. Then the double taxation relief is the lesser of the foreign tax on foreign income against the Kenyan tax on foreign income. That is part one. Number two, number two we are told to calculate the tax payable. Tax payable. Now, for us to get the tax payable, we start with the gross tax liability on the total tax on total income. Gross, gross tax liability of the total tax on the total income was 1,141,800. From this, you are you less you add, you less the personal relief personal personal relief. From the question you are given the personal relief, it was 28,800 per annum. 28,800 per annum. So we less that 28,800. Then we less, we also less the double taxation relief. Double taxation, double taxation relief. For our case, it was 80,000. 80, so if you take, if you take 1 million, 141,800, subtract from 28,800, subtract from 80,000, you're able to get 1 million. 0 33,000 1, 0 33,000 that is our total tax that is the tax payable however you take the gross tax liability you less the personal relief you also less the double taxation relief that's all about this class it was just a brief class on the double taxation relief we said double taxation relief we take is the lesser of Foreign tax on foreign income and the Kenyan tax on foreign income, you take the lesser. That's all about this class. Hope to see you soon. We are going to, in the next class, I'm going to produce a video on the taxation of companies. We are going to see how to tax taxation for companies. By the way, that is video for advanced taxation, CPA, section 6. It's also applicable to ACCA. I was your host, none other than Deko Mohammed. Thank you for watching.